And I feel like it's just like things we've been waiting to say for a minute because it's like, yo, man, like, I, like I'm the biggest Ye fan, like, period. Sometimes I feel like, man, I can't like it because I gotta go against it. Man. But like, that shit tonight was like almost like therapeutic. Like, okay, I'm gonna fucking, you know? He said his piece and he said some crazy shit. I gotta say my shit too. Um, no, you ever nigga. heard the song I did where I no. sampled the beginning of that and then rapped no. over it? No! No! Nigga. No. No. What's good, y'all? It is the Master My Man. So Drake say that he's the biggest Yay fan, man. It's crazy, man. To all of you super Yay meat writers, I just want to say he's not the biggest meat writer, okay? Y'all are the biggest beat writer. You are the biggest free writer. <laughs> but listen, man, on another note, man, that was a time when we loved Drake, man. When Drake was on some super cool vibe, man. I do not know what happened to Drake, man. Rick Ross said he put Molly in her champagne and she didn't know it, man. But it seems like Rick Ross accidentally put that Molly in Drake's champagne and he doesn't know it, man. <laughs> listen, man, it's crazy. Listen, listen, man. I ain't trying to troll Drake in this one, man. I want to wish the best for Drake at this point, man. Because when Drake can be a better person, man, he can use his influence to make the world a better place. Because all you young niggas and niggas who don't got their life sought out, man, Drake can be an example to y'all, man. That's why you need to do the right thing, so he can be the example to create more good stuff in the world, man. So, as I said, man, the niggas can see Drake as an example and do the right thing, man. You know, ain't trying to be a little simp like Drake, man. <laughs> it's better to be a pimp. <laughs> Listen, man. I'm going to move on to something next, man. But I want to say shout out to all the queens watching, man. Love to y'all ladies. I love y'all so much. So find your dreams and the wonder and back on my grind. A second rip my life line told me in my lifetime. Money will help light up the Chicago skyline. And that's why I'm up. 7 o'clock, that's prime time. Anything that came out of his mouth, I ain't got nothing to do with it. I don't care what is in the field. I don't care what he said. I'm telling you, 90% of the time, everything he's saying is something that I don't want you to know. <laughs> man, we have reached the end of this video, man. And remember to share your thoughts in the comments. Let me know how you feel about this. And also remember to drop a like and subscribe, man. Shout out to T Monster Mind. And shout out to Ye, man. This video is dedicated to Kanye West.